feels good to be back in the studio to talk about the 2021 African Cup of Nations. This time around, not on a positive note, but on a sad one. Yes, the positive the press has enjoyed so far by the 2021 African Cup of Nations suffered a blip on Wednesday, January 12, 2022, after a comedy of errors by Zambian referee Yanni Zikawi in a Group F match between Mali and Tunisia. It was one where we saw the Zambian official blew the final whistle after just 85 minutes before restarting play for 4 minutes. But again, blew the whistle with just 89 minutes and 43 seconds of the clash done. Despite the cooling break, lengthy VAR checks for two penalties which were expected to see at that time included on at the end of the game. Unfortunately, Mali coach Mohamed Mungasuba's post-match press conference was later interrupted as it was announced the final three minutes of the game would be played. Well, about 40 minutes later, the Malian players and officials returned to the pitch, but unfortunately, the Tunisian players refused that they had already had their eyes wet. Tunisia's refusal to return to play the remainder of the game led to Zikawi blowing his final whistle once again to call off the match meaning the 1-0 victory for Mali will stand. Yes, disappointing it was from Zikawi, one that didn't go down well with so many football fans in Africa and around the world. And so that brings the question, who is Yanni Zikawi? Well, if you are just watching the channel for the first time, it is Gospel Radio, your number one business radio. Please do well to click the subscription button and leave the notification bell open. Like the show, comment, and share as well. Back to who is Yanni Sikawe. Well, Yanni Sikawe was born in May 26, 1979. He is a teacher by profession and one of Africa's most senior referee. Not just in Africa. Yanni Sikawe is a FIFA licensed referee. He became a FIFA recognized referee in 2007 and called the attention of football decision makers in 2008 when he was drafted in to replace another referee who missed the CAF Under-20 Championship due to illness. Zikawe has since 2008 refereed matches in the CAF Champions League, 2018 FIFA World Cup and the FIFA Club World Cup. At the 2015 African Cup of Nations, Yanni Zikawe handled three matches and also handled the final of the 2016 Club World Cup final between Real Madrid and Casimir RTX. The highest point of his career is handling the final of the 2017 African Cup of Nations, which was contested by the Indomitable Lions of Cameroon and the Pharaohs of Egypt. And if you remember vividly, the Indomitable Lions of Cameroon went as far as winning that competition. At the 2018 World Cup in Russia, Yanni Zikawi was the center man for two group games. He officiated the game between Belgium and Panama, and also the game between Japan and Poland. But unfortunately for Yanni Zikawe, in January 2018, he was caught in first high-profile controversy after an allegation of corruption was filed against him following some decisions he made in a CAF Champions League match between Esperance and Primero Augusto. Happily for him, the ban was lifted in January 2019 following investigations by CAF's disciplinary Committee. And so in all, Yanni Zikawe is one of Africa's football's highly rated referees and it will be expected that his mistakes in the game between Tunisia and Mali are genuine and not influenced by any ulterior motive. And so the final decision is left for CAF to decide. But if you were CAF, what would be your decision? Drop your comments in the comment section there like the show share as well if you are yet to subscribe to our channel please do so and leave the notification bell on it is still brussels radio your number one business radio